this is Victor, aka Mozart the second. We're gonna go ahead and continue tunic. Um, I know it's been a little bit of time since I've actually, re you know, recorded this particular um, part of the series. I know the last time that we were in it, um, I discovered something towards the right hand side, and um, I was doing a little bit of research, and apparently I am supposed to go there. Uh, so let's go ahead and continue that. Um, I believe when I started this particular game, I was on the PC. So what I've decided to do is, since I have an Xbox and I have the Game Pass, um, I can go ahead and continue this game because it, it uses the cross-save function. So I'm going to go ahead and go back. I believe I have a stick, right? Yeah. So I have a stick. So I'm going to use... I'm going to go all the way down. I'm going to use that stick in order to get to where I need to be. You know, it's been a while since I actually played this, so... I might have to rediscover how to get back there. Um, I don't think there's a map. No? No, I remember this. Okay. So, we have... Some stuff, right? Gives us... A little bit of the manual. Okay. A, A to hold. Okay. I get it. That was pretty much it, right? Yeah. So I'm guessing along the way of going through the game, you'll end up finding like pages of the manual or something. There's grave. All right. So I believe I went this way, right? I've also been playing some other games like uh, Hollow Knight and uh, Ori the Blind Ori and the Blind Fire Forest, I think. Um, depending on whether they make those particular um, things a series, they are common games. I haven't I haven't played them before. Um, at least Ori uh, and the Blind Forest. Uh, I was actually freaked out about it because. Um, it's actually a very good game. Okay, I guess I can't go through there. And I think I climbed the ladder over here. Mind you, it's, this is a, one of those things where I, like, I play a game and it's like, I have to come back to it, remember all the controls and everything. What does this say? Bunch of gibberish. Okay. <laughs> uh, I know it's in this general area to um, to find where I was at. I really do like the the colors in this game. It's pretty cool. If I'm not mistaken, this is where... Yeah, East Forest. Okay, so yeah, I was doing some research. Sometimes I'll, I'll take a little bit of time to uh, look where I need to go. And then um, might not look at everything as far as a walkthrough or anything like that. Um, but this game didn't really have too much to explain to us to begin with, right? So there are some games that are out there that um, will, will be like that. And... Um, <laughs> the left trigger has this weird targeting effect. That's actually pretty cool. And I'm starting to see a little bit of what I'm starting to notice as far as like the Xbox. You can see some of the textures kind of doing some weird thing. Um, but I don't think it's going to stop me from playing. Overall, I mean, this kind of does... Rem like remind me of like a Zelda game of some sort and I'm guessing that's where we're gonna have to go right this thing is blocked so let's find out maybe we have to go this way around I mean it's simplistic right 
go down. Oh god, I shouldn't have done that, right? What does this do? Am I gonna have another vision? Yeah. Or is it a save? I'm wondering if it's a save. Can I not pick things up? Man. Fox. See? I don't remember coming down here. Because I don't remember opening up that chest. I know when I got to the point for this area, I was like, mm, I think it was a good stopping point, but let's check it out. Let's see what we got. Oh, we got a whale of some sort. I really wish I had a sword of some sort. Oh, what is that? Don't kill me. I'm going to assume that says well. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I like this area now. These guys actually pack a punch. I mean, it's part of the game, right? I'm assuming I'm going to go into this area. Tag teamed here. I'm about to die. No, I don't want to die. Hero's grave. Well, that's weird. Okay, what's in here though? Great. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, well, let's see what happens when I die. Do I lose all my coins? All my credits? Do I start over? Do I start over where I... S I guess where I initially saved? Wait, what's this? Oh, is this a spirit world? Oh, I... This is... Ah, this is weird. Okay, I remember going through something like this before, when they were dreaming. I'm, I'm assuming that's what we had to do. <laughs> okay, so we end up... Uh, it looks like we got an achievement was resurrected all right hmm well i will turn in my daily quest in a moment so i didn't know about this but apparently um the uh, xbox game pass comes with some like achievements of some sort that you can get while playing the games and um which i thought was interesting because you get some points and then you can redeem points for like specific rewards like a gift card or something if you get enough points and so i've been using um there's this the xbox uh app on my phone which i have android um i think Apple probably has the same thing too. Um, I can't say for sure, but oh, do I get to redeem myself? Let's see if I can attack all these guys here. Hopefully what I can do, can I get all those credits back? Ha ha ha! I got them all back. Okay, so it has like a Diablo uh, 2 where if you die, you can redeem some of your stuff back. Or most of your stuff back, I guess. Because I can't remember how many I did have. 
And I know for a fact that the way the level is laid out, there's a chest here. But I can't remember if... I don't, I don't think it does. We'll see what happens. Maybe I shouldn't be going this way. I know there's a chest here, though. But I'm curious what's in here. It's a potion! Or something with a heart. I'm gonna assume it's a potion. Wait, have I had these all this time and I just didn't realize it? No, no. Yeah, it looks like I only had one. Okay. It looks like somebody's up there. But it doesn't look like I can get anywhere on this area. So, hmm. I am so confused. Because it doesn't look like there's a ladder here, so I, I'm assuming I have to go out the way I came in and then go towards the sword, I guess? I guess we'll see what happens. Yeah. I guess we'll f follow this area. There's another save point, just in case I die, I guess. What is this? What what does that mean? I, I don't know. <laughs> Let's say okay. Oh, okay. So we got the targeting. S tell me something I don't know. <laughs> uh, understanding stamina points. Stamina points. Blah blah blah. Stamina points. Zero SP. You can always attack even without stamina. Okay. Movement. Movement of safety. Vulnerability. I'm guessing when you're tumbling, you have a vulnerability. Check your dust. Stability. Oh, I'm guessing when you're rolling, you can be knocked over? Yeah. Flinch, knock over. 25% HP? Maybe? I don't know. I guess we'll have to check it out as we go along. <laughs> Okay. So, here's a ladder. Hopefully I don't die. Oh, Lord. No. Mm -mm. I need a regular sword. I don't think I can get him with, <laughs> with a stick. Come on. What's this? Hero's grave is still towards that way. Now, can I hit these things? Oh, ho, ho. Okay. But I feel like... I feel like it was pointing the other way. Path to the hero's grave. Okay. Let's see. Yo. Okay, I beat him. Is this something that I have to move? I, I don't think I can move any blocks. I think I'm gonna live. Dang. See, that's what I was afraid of. Now I gotta come back, but I think the save point's not that bad. Because we're a little bit further than we were beforehand. So we know not to go up the ladder. Uh, we didn't go in there, which I'm wondering if we should. Let's check. Let's check first. It's weird. It looks like I can move this, but I can't yet. So I'm assuming we can't do anything there. Trying to think. So then we got to go back out this way then. So I'm thinking this is going to be a kind of a long series. Um, 
just because I may end up cutting them into like 15 well we're at 15 right now um, so maybe a 30 minute episode or something I mean it is a simplistic game so I'm not gonna try to wait they responded didn't they so that means okay I died again. I died again. So I, I gotta figure out how to, um... Oh, there's no block. We don't have anything else, right? No. Wait, we got a potion. Ha! I didn't see that before. Do we get a refill of a potion every time we die? Manual needs to have that, right? Okay. Well, let's see if I can do this. Okay, that did not help. afraid I'm gonna get everything but these guys are gonna kill me well, that, that looks like we have to come up here I believe Please not be a big thing. <laughs> oh my god! That... Yeah. So I can fight them. Well, I only have a stick. <laughs> oh man. Well. Let's find out something. That I died. So how wait, did you see that? They moved the block. So wait, let me check something. I have an idea. They did. They moved blocks. Ah. Okay, so you see what happened there? They hit those blocks and they tipped them over, so... I'm wondering if I have to do something like that. Now I gotta go back, get my stuff. Okay. So, I can't do it with my stick. But they can do it with their things. Is there... There's nothing here, right? Yeah, no. So, I'm just gonna have to dodge really good. The life of a gamer. I'm kind of wondering, can I... I don't have to beat the big one. And if I just have to beat these guys. Okay, so I have to use like a, a hit and then roll? Dude's here. 
Uh... Ah! Dude, that was... That was actually nerve-wracking. Give me your sword, man. Okay. No. Open the door. Open. <laughs> oh, man. Was I supposed to use him to... Okay, hold on. Wait. They're not blocks. They're trees. What? That's so weird. I'm assuming this fox is supposed to be able to do this. I'm not gonna lie though, this is a very calming game, so I'm not like... ...stressing out about it too much. Oh, but Jesus. Okay. We finally got a sword. I am assuming so, right? Yeah, take the sword. Wah, wah, wah. A sword. A sword was found. Okay. So, am I supposed to do that? Okay, so I had to hit my left button, and I'm going to. Put my X button as the sword and then the stick as Y. Don't know why I would need it, but we'll see what happens. So now I should be able to hit those blocks and clear a path. Sweet. But I, I didn't really notice it, but they're trees. I'm also assuming that now I can mess some stuff up. Now I can clear paths. Oh. Okay, I got too cocky. Yeah, see, this is weird, though, because, like, now I still have more questions. So, we'll go up here. Now that we have the sword. Oh, you know what? No. I'm wondering, can I go back to this thing and save again? Yeah. So I don't have to go get the sword again. So there's two places we can go, maybe a couple more places. Um, we have the place up here, which has the chest. Oh, it knocks them back. Sweet. Well, that one's a different color. Okay, I don't want to go too far. I know I'm going to end up having to go down here. Let's see. Well, let's see. Because I think this one said Guardhouse 2. So I think we have to hit those trees to get through so we can get the chest, and then we can use the ladder to go down. Bombs, I think. We may have to use it here. We'll see.
Got an idea. So I guess I'll assign that one to B. And then... <laughs> so it worked. So they're like fire bombs? So I'm guessing that probably wouldn't go through the, what do you call it, the wall that we just passed. I just want to make sure there's not another place out here. Play enough Mario games to know that. Mm, stamina juice maybe, or mana? Hold on. All right. Yeah, I was gonna say, uh, I've done enough Mario uh, games to know that there's always a secret passage somewhere. So let's see. I guess we could continue to go through here. I, I don't know what we're gonna find. I really wish we had a map of some sort. We'll see. So this is the lower forest. What is that? Oh, is there gonna be a grapple? There's gonna be a grapple somewhere. I don't know if you saw that, but if you can look on the uh, lower right hand corner, you could see that there's another hook of some sort. So I'm guessing there's some type of rope or something, or I don't know. I could be talking out of my butt here. Okay, here's another chest. What is that? Great. What? What? Oh my god. Oh my god. Rolling away. <laughs> oh my god. What? Okay. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe we should backtrack. Maybe that, that should be one of the things that we have to do. I want to heal up. I'm kind of wondering if... I need to, um, see, there's nothing there. Yeah, I think I may need have, I might have to backtrack a little bit. It's weird, though, because we did get someone, something that looks like a f dynamite or firecracker or something like that. Um, okay, so that was, that was the hero sword. We got the hero sword. Um, I want to know how to get over there. Oh, what is that? You know what? I should save, right? When in doubt, always save. So it seems like you have to go to this monument of some sort to save. It'll save your process, uh, progress. Progress. <laughs> um, and it looks like it refills the potion too. Ah, uh, but it spawns these people. So, okay. I'm guessing we're gonna just have to backtrack to where we were before. I mean, I feel like I'm getting a little bit further than what we had began with. And I don't think there is a right way to play this game. It's just like kind of exploration and stuff like that. Um, since I play like games on different systems all the time, um, this is one of the games I don't see on sale a lot. 
So this is the guardhouse one, which we were in uh, because of the things that were below. Eggshell, maybe? I'm not too sure. So I'm guessing our... Okay. Ha! The ladder. Okay. So what is this? So that goes back to where we started. Oh! Okay. Well, I will not do... Oh! I, I killed myself. Yeah, I killed myself. I killed myself. That, that... Maybe I shouldn't do those bumps. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Well, it wasn't that far. So let's do this. Okay. So those bombs didn't refill. I'm gonna put those. Mm. Let's see how that works. Oh, I see. So when you target them, it it shows you how much life there is. And I've already opened this door so that well, you know what? Yeah. That's interesting. I shouldn't have gone through, if that makes sense. I should have, like, had to activate all those things, so I'm guessing it saves that process? Okay. So... Eh, I hurt myself. Again. Whoa! Okay, so it looks like... Uh, I think I'm gonna have to do a lot of rolling. Um, and of course those bombs aren't gonna help me. But I'm wondering if that stamina is supposed to help me a little bit. So let's change over to that. So we don't hurt ourselves, that's one. And then... We'll go back up. See if we can try not to get hit. All right. Going all the way through. One more time. I do find it a little bit odd that I didn't have to activate those switches anymore because it didn't really save at a certain point but that's cool all right whoa cool okay so I beat him where's where's the save <laughs> <laughs> oh god. There better be something good in this area <laughs> or a saving spot. Okay, there's a chest. Is another spider gonna come at me? A potion. All that for a potion. Oh, okay, I see. Is there anything over here? No. 
Okay. I can, yeah, there we go. Take the coin. Alright, cool. Doesn't look like there's anything over here. Alright, let's go up here. Uh, can I hit that? I guess as long as it doesn't look like dynamite or something, maybe. I don't know, I'm a little curious about the spiders. Um. Whoa. Oh! Okay. I'm guessing that's supposed to happen. So, if my memory serves me correct, if I go here, no, I thought, I thought you see the insignia that the three, uh, was it pentagons? I thought they were going to symbolize something, but I see something over here. I'm wondering if this rope has anything to do with what I need. Oh, I didn't even see that. Cool. Okay. So that's done. Oh, look at that. Somehow I have two potions now. I'm guessing when I got that, that secondary one. Okay. So now... If there's anything in my way, I'm pretty sure I'm still gonna have to like explore this forest area. Now my question is, was this all we needed to do? More questions. <laughs> Let's check out one thing, though. Well, I mean, now I can explore a little bit better. I didn't know those things were trees. What is this? Sure, I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, so here's a map. That is so much better. Okay, ringing the west bell. Old house, bell tower, west garden. To east forest. Which is how we got to where we needed to. Um, so I'm guessing we're supposed to ring those bells. <laughs> Under the well. We passed the well, didn't we? Huh. Slurm, a type of slime who wants to be close to you, stun it by blocking it. I need a shield. So we need to find the shield before we can go down the well. Okay. Oh, that's so much easier to, to defeat now. Hey, look, another thing that we can do. <laughs> oh, a ladder. Look at that. Oh, 
All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and save here. Or at least see what if there's any movie thingy. If there's not a movie thingy, then it's just a save point. It's just weird because, like, when we first died, we were in the afterlife. But anyways, uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and s stop here. Uh, my name is Victor, a.k.a. Mozart II, and uh, this was Tunic. Uh, go ahead and uh, give a like if you like the, the, the gameplay. If not, uh, leave a comment. Uh, let me know uh, if you're curious about any of this particular game. Uh, I don't know too much other than I know a lot of it doesn't really have too much English, uh, as you can see with all the symbols. Um, but anyways, my name's Victor, a.k.a. Mozart II. Y'all have a nice one.